Okay, hello and welcome everybody. This is going to be another faction reveal for Total War Tiller. Uh, I'll explain a few things in a minute, which I've just realised myself and should have realised on the first reveal. These are basically all factions from Rome Total War Barbarian Invasion. So what we're getting here is basically Rome 2's version of it, update graphics, etc, etc. I'll go through that in a second now. I'll read the information, do the Wikipedia, well I'll do the... Uh, the faction list for Barbarian Invasion for Rome 1 and then I'll do the Wikipedia about the Allens itself. Today's faction is the Allens which is another Barbarian faction. As you can tell here again with no real settlements they're dotted around the Black Sea so obviously this is where Royal Scythia would be. You've got Chimera there as well. You've got the Crimea which obviously modern day Ukraine slash Russia now uh, and then Pontus Greece etc etc. So they're not actually for according to this, they're probably not too far away from the Visigoths, which would be in this area, and then you've got the Eastern Roman Empire there. But anyway, let's read this. As the Alani ride into battle, bloody scalps displayed proudly on their saddles. Few can dispute their reputation for unsurpassed fer ferocity. The only god they worship is a sword painted in the earth, and they favour a life of relentless conquest. Yet even the Alani wavered in the face of the Huns and the relentless pillaging that followed in their wake. Many fed the carnage, becoming pawns to Rome's and to Romans and Vandals, while others joined the Huns in search of me of plunder. Those that remained with the tribe, however, possessed the spirit of independence that hitherto defined them. They alone can restore the name and fortunes of the Alani people. Beginning the campaign on the edges of the Black Sea, the Alans lie precariously close to the heartland of the Huns. Born in a saddle, these warriors are peerless horsemen, but they also understand the value of the chain of the charges of their charges and they adapt to keeping them alive with the odds are stacked against them and funnily enough as you can see here in the faction unit roster picture they've got obviously infantry units with horse uh, with horse <laughs> with, <laughs> with dogs so this is like a mixture of the warhounds so that's the the guys who are obviously with them the handlers but they seem pretty decent themselves with spear units so that'd be interesting to see and as i mentioned going to the uh, factionist for to, uh, Rome Total War Barbarian Invasion which I did like at the time if you already go through the list of the factions which are playable in the game guess what we've already had so far Western Roman Empire which hasn't been a thing yet but obviously will be playable Eastern Roman Empire the Huns which you know we know at the moment is not playable the Goths which has been revealed the Vandals which has been revealed the Saxons was revealed at EGX the Franks is going to be self-explanatory because you know the Visigoths were mentioned them as well Sassanids, which you've already had. These guys we haven't, but that could be the Allens anyways. Elemanani. That could be the Allens, but just uh, spelt it diff li a little bit differently. And we've got Samaritans, so that could be another potential. So basically, we're getting Barbarian Invasion, <laughs> which is a bit annoying, but at the same time, I did like the game, you know, and God knows how many years ago this was. What does it say? 2005. It's nearly 10 years old since that's come out, so obviously games have changed and the graphics and all that. So, you know, it's still going to be interesting, but it's a bit annoying at the same time. But what can you do? But tomorrow's faction reveal, we will have the Bobs. Thursday will be the Daves, and Friday will be the Tonys. So we've had the Allens today, we've got the rest of the other names next during the week. Um, this bit of information about the Allens. And we'll go into that picture as well. This is obviously historical about them now. Um, there were a group of Samaritan, tri Samaritan tribes from their realm. Obviously, they're pretty much the same as the Huns and other ones. Like They've come from this area over here. Migrated. They're very horse, well, Scythia, Huns, Mongols, kind of, you know, nomadic kind of tribes. They've obviously gone to Ram. This is their military conquest as well. They migrate through here to the Eastern Roman Empire, which they, you see them about here on, the, on that picture that they showed. Go to France, Spain, supposedly North Africa. I don't really know about that. I think that's more the Vandals. This might be other factions, but the Barbarian expansion. 4th to the 5th centuries AD. But we've got the early Allens, so let's read this. They're born in the Pontus Black Sea kind of area. We're also working with the Persian sources. Okay. Let's see who this is. Okay, so we've got a couple of these factions already. 
you've got the REOC and the Series E's, which are around the Black Sea area, which we're in Rome to now. So it's basically a mixture of them kind of tribes. Uh, Armenians, Medes as well. Now the IC live alongside the Tanis, but the Series E's live blah blah blah. Caucus. So I think it's a mixture of all them kind of tribes. Uh, what have we got here? So they around 370, the Alans were overwhelmed by the Huns. They were divided into several groups, some of them who fled westward. A portion of these western Alans, Alans joined the Vandals. Okay, so that's where the North Africa thing comes into it. And the Suevis, an invasion of Roman Gaul. Oh, that might be just the invasion of uh, France. So, yeah, basically they've obviously helped out the... Western Roman Empire to attack the Franks, so they join, so you've got the Alans, the Vandals, and these guys attacking the Franks, because obviously the Vandals in the previous one, they said they'd done that, they were working with the Roman Empire for that, so auxiliary troops and so forth. Uh, then he went to Spain and Africa, following the, the fortunes of the Vandals and Suevi into the Iberian Peninsula, the Alans led by someone settled in the province of Lustiani, or Lustiani, and Carthage. Or previous uh, settlements were owned by these guys. And the king Atasis was killed in battle against the Visigoths. Uh, okay. But, so, there are some vestiges of the Alans in Portugal, namely in. Da, 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 castle, blah blah blah. And Alans in Eastern Europe. Some historians, in, some historians argue that the arrival of the Huns, the European step forced the portion of Alans previously living there to move northwest to the land of Venedes, possibly merging with western Balts. They had to become a precursors of the historic Slav nations. Oh, so the Baltic. So these guys suppose, supposedly went towards the Baltic kind of area as well. Uh, showing the location of Alans. Okay. Sassanid Empire. Albania. Uh, where are the Alans then? Okay, yeah, so this is what I was saying before, is that the, I, I, so, the RC and the Syracese around this area, so this is where they originally formulated, and then they went towards the west, or up there. So they migrate quite a bit though, these guys. And then they went towards the Baltic area as well. I don't know too much about them, but, you know, that's the information I do know. Obviously they're migrating faction, and it's a bit of a shame that this is basically what we're going to be getting. We might be getting some extra factions like this, like unplayable factions. We might get the uh, the Celts, the Burgundies, the Lombards, the Berbers. We don't know, but for the playable list of factions for Total War Barbarian Invasion, pretty much what we're getting now, if you look at that. Eastern, Visigoths, Vandals, Sassanid, Alans. Eastern, Vandals, Sassanids, and I assume that's the Alans. Oh, no, they're not, actually. My bad. This is Swaby Germanic tribes. But either way, that is today's reveal. I will be doing a faction straw poll slash channel update a little bit later. So check out for that. And uh, I'll see you all next time.